Well, the big fascination these days seems to be Facebook and um, MySpace, especially Facebook. And um, the two guys who created that were college students. Talk about enterprising. They're just 25 or 26 now, and they're filthy rich when they were just poor students six years ago. But what they've created is really a very good network as far as messages and messaging and getting the word across and what have you. Uh, it's a good program. Of course, I wouldn't put anything too confidential on my... Uh, some people put their status as to what they're up to. I, I never do that. I don't usually say going to the mall, going to the grocery store, going to... It's probably better not to tell not to tell Facebook exactly what time you're not going to be home. You just never know who's reading your profile. No matter how private it is, you just never know who can see your wall or why or what they might do. So, it's very much like that. If anything, I've learned from Facebook, it's a lot like that Bowling for Soup song that says high school never ends. Because it is. It's just, it's gossip. Just 20 plus years after having graduated high school, 39 years old now, and you know, I'm like, gee, this is just like, it's almost like deja vu. It's like a little bit of gossip, or so and so is doing this, so and so is doing that. Um, I don't know, it's funny. Not, you know, it's okay. It's just in a, in a bizarre sense. It's just interesting that uh, it's turned out that way. That. It's kind of like reverting back to high school. If I had the energy I had at 18, oh, man. I've got the ambition mentally. I just can't run like I used to. But, you know, what can you do? Something my dad always used to say, growing old is inevitable, but growing up is an option. He still says that. But... He's in the backside of 70 now, so that's 77 now. Yeah. So that's um, that's worked for him. Anyhow, uh, where are we going? Um, Sunday afternoon. It's almost 12:30. Uh, not much happening here. It's beautiful, beautiful, sunshining day. And my favorite football team, the Buffalo Bills, are not going to lose today. <laughs> All right, um, can't really, there's not a whole lot of other gossip going on right now that, um, or gossip news that I care to comment on or anything like that. Um, I don't know. So, I'd talk about more, I guess, but there really hasn't been too much happening lately, which is probably a good thing. Uh, I've always been of the opinion of no news is good news. Like, um, Corey Mr. Safety Williams has a blog that says, Do people really care? And the question is, How are you? And he actually tested the theory. He asked people, How are you? And, you know, got different answers. He said that, came to the conclusion that if they say hi or good, they're actually having a good day. If they say what's up, they really don't care how your day's going. That was his conclusion. It's probably, it's probably a good opinion, and it's somewhat researched there. But, uh, so, I think when, when you say, I think that works for when you say what's new or what's going on, people say, eh, nothing. That means it's gone just about the way they've expected it to. All right, well, I don't know, maybe I'll video more a little bit later. I just haven't really had a whole lot of new gossip. Oh, I know. Uh, it's been asked before what you always have on hand with you. There's a few things I always have with me. Um, I always carry a pocket knife in my, in my pocket. I always keep uh, a pair of work gloves on the dash of my truck because you just never know when you're going to pick up something that's either dirty and you don't want to pick it up or it has sharp edges. I always keep that laptop with me. Uh, it's not a great laptop. It's about an eight-year-old gateway, but yeah, it does for me what I need it to. It's got like the cellular phone plug-in if I need to go online. It doesn't have a wireless router. It's too old for that. Uh, I try to keep the bed of my truck empty, although I think there's a box of old books I gotta throw out that's in there right now. 
Uh, I try to keep the bed of the truck empty. I always keep that snow rake and those jumper cables with me too. Always want to keep that on hand. Anyhow, that's about it for now. Happy Sunday.